right, today we're going to be looking at finding the area of a sector. We have a real life problem here. A lawn sprinkler located at the corner of a yard rotates through 90 degrees and sprays water 30 feet. What is the area of the sector water? So we're looking at finding this, the area of this sector. We know that our theta here is 90 degrees and what happens is our radius of our circle here becomes 30 feet because that's how far the water sprays. And up top here I'm going to write the formula for area. It's always a good idea to know what you're starting with. So area of a sector is one half times theta times r squared. Now we recall of course that theta has to be in radians. So when we have theta equal to 90 degrees we can convert that to radians by saying 90 times pi over 180 which is the conversion factor for converting to radians and so we end up with 90 pi over 180 which is equal to pi over 2. If we would have looked at the unit circle we would know that 90 degrees would also be pi over 2. So now what we could do is we can go through and we can set up our area equation and fill in what we know. So we have 1 half times theta in radians which is pi over 2 and we're going to multiply that by our radius which is 30 feet and we're squaring that so that's equal to 1 half times 900 pi over 2 because pi times 30 squared would be 900 pi we're dividing that by 2 so we have 900 pi over 4 because 1 half times 900 pi over 2 would be 900 pi over 4. That's going to give us 225 pi. But also if we wanted to convert that into say a decimal value answer that would be approximately equal to 707 feet squared. And so the area of our sector over here is 707 feet squared and that is how much area is covered if the sprinkler is located at a corner and it sprays through a 90 degree angle.